Okay, so we have a uh, HP DV DV ninety seven hundred. They came back to us, said that the video is not working on it, that the uh, video went out. So what we're going to do is we plugged it in. We're going to turn it on and see what happens. So we have our lights, and let's see about our screen. Our screen's engaged. So we have that. Um, so we're going to, wow, I've never saw that before. So we have a haze coming and going from the screen. Uh, it seems to be like a, wow, this is very odd. The whole entire time the system's still on. So we'll see what happens. Let's see if the hard drive light turns on. This whole time we've still got what appears to be pixelation and stuff. The hard drive is running, so we don't have a CD or anything in there. This appears to be the hard drive booting up, and we have the screen looking like that. So this is not linked to our reflow process. This is something completely different. So what I'm going to do is take and shut this video down. We'll take an external screen and plug it up to it and see what happens and see if we get a display on an external screen. And that'll be a way for us to test it. So let's cut the video off and then go to that. Okay, so now we've cleaned the contacts and checked and we see that the uh, Wi-Fi is going. The hard drive had booted up and we see video on the screen. We've actually logged it in as a user, um, but we can log it out and see that there are two users on here. So we'll go and do that real quick. We'll just log off. Now, this was only after running the system for maybe five or ten minutes, the screen actually turned on. Uh, there were no reboots or anything like that. It just ran, and then the system turned on. So, our best case scenario, we do not see it being a, uh, being a reflow issue because we ran it for... 30 minutes like this so far and we can reboot it and see that it you know turns on hard drive runs uh, just like before uh, lights come on video comes on uh, the DVD drive syncs and we see that everything starts up so Best case scenario, what we believe is that it's linked to the screen, whether it be the VGA cable was dirty or the actual screen uh, turned on. You know, we, <coughs> we clearly did check it before, but, um, you know, after letting it sit and get the haze off the screen and heat up, it may be the inverter that's going bad in it that causes it to actually do that. But needless to say, the system is actually turned on and it's working. So we're going to call this one complete, and then we'll get in touch with the customer to see if they want to change any parts out or do anything like that. So we have a boot up. So we know that it's good. We know that the system is uh, good and the reflow held.